ahead. Thank you very much. Well, thank you, Fred. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to see you a little bit later. Because she's going to tell you a story about a little bitty ant. Yeah. And I'll see you a little bit. Okay, Fred, we'll see you a little bit. Mm -hmm. He does like those flies, doesn't he? So this is a story about a little bitty ant. Can you put your hands together like little bitty, bitty, bitty? You've seen little bitty ants before? You know what she was doing? She was walking along in the month of October, which is this October. month. That's good. That's when my birthday is. Your birthday's in October. That's awesome. So, well, this is what happened. You never know what the weather will be in October, right? You never know. That's right. Yeah, that's cool. I love it. Too, so much. Too much. And she's walking along looking for a little sugar cookie crumb. And you never know what the weather will be in October. And up in the clouds were these grande snowflakes and grande clouds. And she's walking along and a dust devil came up. She grabbed a leaf and she was carried clear over to a Native American tribe, Pueblo. Because this is in the Southwest where I'm talking about these stories. And she came down, holding the leaf down, 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 down to the Santa Ana Pueblo. And up in the clouds were what? Great big snowflakes. They began to fall. One of them landed on her leg and it broke her leg. Ay, copa de nieve broke me patita. Those paritos, two birds, landed beside her and said, Anita, you could ask the sun. He's so big and warm, he could help you. So she went to the sun and she said, El sol, copa de nieve broke me patita. But the sun said, I can't help you. The cloud covers me. Ask a cloud. So she went to the cloud. El nube, copa de nieve broke me patita. Could you fix my patita? But the cloud said, the adobe wall stops me. The wind blows me. And so she went over to the wind. I Ariel. What did you say? The adobe wall stops me. So she went to the adobe wall. La pared, copa de nieve broke me petita. Could you fix my petita? But the wall said, I can't help you. You know, that rat, he digs me. So she went to the rat. El ratón, copa de nieve broke me petita. Could you fix my petita? But the rat said, me, you know, those cats, they chase me. So she went to a cat, el gato. Well, what happened? Copa de nieve broke me petita. The snowflakes broke my little bitty leg. Oh, I can't help you. You know what chases a cat? A dog. Yes, that's right. El perro, the dog. She went to the dog. Woof, woof, what happened? Copa de nieve broke my petita. But the dog said, I can't help you. You know, the sticks, they hit me. Oh, go find the stick. So she went to the stick. El Paulo, copa de nieve broke me petita. Could you fix my petita? But the stick said, I can't help you, I'm sorry. You know, the fire burns me. So she went to the fire. La Lumbe, copa de nieve, rug me petita. Could you fix my petita? But the fire says, oh, yeah, yeah. You know what puts a fire out? Water. Water. Agua. So she went to the water. Blah, 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 I see. Blah, 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 blah. And you're all. Petita is broken. See, El Agua. Could you fix it? Blah, blah, blah. I'm sorry, but the ox drinks me. Ay, 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 oh my goodness, the ox. So she goes to the ox. El boy, copa de nieve broke me petita. Could you fix my petita? El boy said, no, Anita. You have a very little petita. I can't help you. Ask the knife in the blacksmith shop. It kills me. Hey. Oh. Well, uh, oh, so she went to the knife in the blacksmith shop. Copa de nieve broke me petita. Could you fix my petita? But the knife said, you see the man? Herrero made me. Ask him. Ay, ay, ay. A man! A man! So she went to the man and she said, Herrero? See? Copa de nieve broke me petita. Could you fix my petita? But the man said, I'm sorry. That's a very little petita. Ask the oaks. Oh. So she went to God. And she said, you know, Zanita, and the copa de nieve broke me petita. Could you fix my petita? And God said, yes. Don't go out in the month of October when the big snowflakes are falling. Okay. And then Herrero had an idea. 
And he took the knife and he took a hair from the ox's tail and cut the hair off and wrapped it around her leg. And then he took dirt from the wall and water and mixed mud and put the mud upon her leg. And then he laid her by the fire and it dried to a hard mud cast. And then El Pedro came with a stick. Would you like to go over to the wall? Si, sí, gracias. El Roton might help you. Si, sí, gracias. El Roton said, you may go through this hole in the wall. El Gato can help you. Maybe she'll take you home. Si, sí, gracias. El Gato said, you may ride on my paw and I will take you all the way home. Si, sí, gracias. So the cat, El Gato, took her all the way home. And the wind blew the clouds away from the sun. And the sun shone down and melted the snow. And she went into her home. And she was warm. And she was healed. And she kept her promise to Dios not to go out in the month of October when the big snowflakes were falling. And that's Anita La Oraleguita. That story's been in a few books. And so a few books have uh, The Day of Snow's Tortillas is a version of that story that's been around a little bit of time. So we've told a little bit of Spanish stories today. And I'm so glad you guys all got to come out here and be with us. And we are your friends.